This is WHRV News. I'm Sam Turkin. Many Virginians are underpaying for flood insurance. That's according to a new national study by the climate risk nonprofit, the First Street Foundation. The federal government will soon start raising insurance rates. The average flood insurance premium for Virginia properties in the most flood prone areas is about $1,800. The First Street Foundation estimates rates should actually be about double that. Nationally, premiums for millions of homes should quadruple to keep up with the cost of flood damage. Matthew Eby is executive director of First Street. It's not going to stop there. From a changing climate, these risks are going to continue to grow as we see sea level rise and precipitation patterns change. The federal government provides most flood insurance. Rates are lower than they should be because officials have tried to keep premiums affordable for people. But that's forced the National Flood Insurance Program to pick up the tab for flood damage and rack up tens of billions in debt. To help fix that, the government will start raising insurance rates later this year. Elizabeth Andrews directs the Virginia Coastal Policy Center. She says the new premiums could be too expensive for a lot of people. There is going to be a point where some communities are going to have to say, we are going to be leaving this area, and it's going to be a lot of tough choices. Federal officials say any jumps in insurance premiums will be spread out over years. Sam Turkin, WHRV News.